Now to a story that could literally save lives. It has to do with the heart. More specifically, the warning signs that you may be in danger of cardiac arrest. This, of course, comes into light of two different situations that got worldwide attention. The first involving Buffalo Bills player DeMar Hamlin, who had a cardiac event on the field and had to be resuscitated. He was just 24 years old. And then there is the story of Lisa Marie Presley, who died suddenly last week after going into full cardiac arrest. She was just 54 years old. So what are the warning signs that your heart could be in jeopardy? Our Iran Hammy spoke to an expert in saving lives when it matters most. It can truly happen to anybody. A common misconception is that a heart attack and cardiac arrest are the same thing. They aren't. There's a difference. Christina Perry, vice president of cardiology at Christus Spahn, says a heart attack is a blockage in the arteries to the heart. Cardiac arrest is an electrical malfunction to the entire heart. A heart attack could lead to cardiac arrest. So a heart attack is when you so you'll see people saying they have that crushing chest pain or the arm pain, jaw pain, but they're still conscious and their heart is still beating. It's just having difficulty. With cardiac arrest, they truly have no heartbeat. In the case of cardiac arrest, those people have to be treated quickly. We saw that in the case of DeMar Hamlin. Perry says to first check for a pulse and breathing. You want someone to call 911 and you want to do CPR if you know how. Even if it's only hands-only CPR, that still can make a wonderful difference to someone's life. Perry says cardiac arrest could happen to anyone, but those with heart disease are more susceptible. According to the American Heart Association, one in three Americans has a heart disease. Typically, a cardiac arrest we cannot predict. It is possible for anyone to decrease their risk, she said. Not smoking and having an exercise routine can help. Once you're aware that you have cardiac disease, you know, you're going to be placed on a prescription med regimen typically for high cholesterol or high blood pressure, diabetes. So making sure you keep up with your medications, making sure you visit your physicians regularly. The American Heart Association reports there are more than 356,000 cardiac arrests each year in the U.S. If you have any questions about your health, you should consult with your primary physician. Reporting in Corpus Christi, Iran Hammy, Chris 6 News.